What goes in hard and dry but comes out soft and wet? There's so many things on so many levels that you could say. There's, yeah, it's so there many is. things you could say. There's, yeah, um, there's a lot. I bet it's sounds really your character, stupid. Whatever your answer is. I bet it's really stupid. Yeah, I bet I'm, it got to be something really simple. I'm going to hold stupid. off on answering because he brought up a point. You know, it's going to cause character issues and people watching. Just it. answer the damn question. I, I don't know. I don't. Let me go. Uh, uh. Because I know it's going to be something stupid. You got to guess? Anything? I know it's going to be something stupid. Just guess, right? Real quick. Just bam. Just throw it out there. I don't have one. <laughs> Hard and dry. Comes out soft and wet. That's. It sounds so terrible. Gotta take it so long. I don't, nucleic I don't DNA. DNA. <laughs> <laughs> nucleic DNA. That's a hell of an answer. That, no. <laughs> no. No. <laughs> it's the nerdiest answer I got. Jay. Hey, bro. It, that's better. Than, <laughs> I, I have no answer. I don't know. Gum. Start the show. Start the show. God dang it. Start the show, man. Start it. I'm done. I mean, it has DNA. Oh, okay, right. I don't care. I that, quit. Oh, I'm done. That is so true. Damn, man. <laughs> it goes hard and dry. And you eat it it, comes it is. Out it well. is. Any way you look at that, he is 100% right. Great. So we got one more. Yeah, one more before, uh, before we go ahead and start the show. Okay. And then I'll, I'll do these other three. Three? Yeah, bro. Yeah. He's got, he's got, five. he's got a source now. I already did one. He has a Four source. So Dang. this is the first one. All right. I don't like her right now. No, I, you got to thank Domingo on this one. You remember Day? You remember Day sent that message that said her, her oh, lack of judgment? Oh, that one. This, yes, this is it. Yeah. All right. Yeah. So, Ray, this one's for you. Yeah, I kind of, I kind of know this joke. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> He's apologizing. I already let me know right there. All right. So Ray, this is a poorly drawn. I just did it real fast. Okay. So anyway, all right. So what is this? It's a bird. What is this part? It's a beak. What is this part? A tail. What's this part? Feet. Okay. And what is this part right here? The wing. Okay. Now I want to fold this up real quick. Now. Remember that last word I told you, right? The last word you said? The wing. Yeah. Okay. Now say that say that three times. Wing, wing, wing. Okay, hold on. Hello. You. F <laughs> I hate you. I hate you. It's so stupid. It's so stupid. Yes, it is. I hate you. <laughs> oh my god. It's so stupid. Yes. <laughs> yes, it is. I hate you. Damn uh, it. They was uh, like, how are you going to do that on the phone? Damn like, it, man. I, that, that's not <laughs> fair, man. I, you know what? I do really bad dad jokes to my kids. And th it is not on the level of this. That was terrible. But it was, it's so bad to where it is. It's so bad. Damn you, Tyler. Just damn you for that. <laughs> this is, that was terrible. But it was funny. Because I fell yeah. right into it. Like, I'm looking at him think, doing this. And I think couldn't. Domingo on that one because he. He has somebody on his route, and she told her she did that to him, and I laughed. I was like, I have to. Do that. Yeah, I was like, <laughs> and she was like, funny, right? And I was like, oh my god. And then I was like, you and my best friend, and she was like, well, your best friend's awesome. Yeah, so now, and I was like, no. Now you gotta shout her out, and then show her this this episode. I have to shout her out. Okay, you don't want to shout her out, then? Well, that was for you. Thank you, Ashton, for that joke. That was a very stupid joke. I don't. 
Yeah, and you see we modified it a little bit. Now you can do it without having people. But yeah, that, yeah, thank Stop you. Dad jokes. Even, Good job, Stop Ashton. Ashton Reed, table. who works at uh, the tee offs, men's tee offs. So. Stop Go giving this man ammo. We don't give Tyler ammo no more. Snake <laughs> is no more ammo. Stop he this. Needs no, that's hey, luckily, the best friend I was talking about. This guy. Maybe, maybe, you, seen it. maybe you seen it. Maybe you seen it. You can get some jokes from me. Talk nerdy to me. Get nerdy with me. Welcome so back. Welcome to uh, this is episode 23. Mm-hmm. Uh, we're on your boy Snake. Amigo D. And of course, I am the hammer. And we are your hosts. Yeah. <laughs> Bingo. Go. Yeah. Boom. What up, people? What up? What up? Uh, I apologize for Snake and his crazy dad jokes, friend jokes, the people, cheese. weird cheese jokes. So, anyway, let's jump right into it. So, last week we talked about the state of streaming. I told you guys I was going to watch a couple of things to get some stuff going. So, I watched Power, and I will have to say that um, it's pretty good. Um, uh, and by Power, I'm not talking about the uh, Showtime. Uh, is it Showtime? Yeah, the Showtime uh, drama, you know, with yeah, 50 not, Cent. I'm not talking 50 about cent, the, yeah. <laughs> talking about the movie with Jamie Foxx that came on Netflix. But both are pretty good. Uh, the other one, if you haven't watched that one, it's a five, six seasons, probably more than that. Go watch it. I haven't really jumped into that. People say it's good. It's all right. I watch it. It's all right. No. So go watch it. If you like 50 Cent and people and people cutting and killing each other and sex and whatnot, go watch it. Uh, anywho, or anyway, uh, <laughs> let's let's jump into power. Power, um, I thought it was pretty good. Now, the first thing I'm gonna say before I go into critiquing the actual movie, I wanna say I have a big problem, and this isn't just with Netflix, but I have but it's in general, but Netflix has been doing it a lot lately. I cannot stand their marketing. I cannot stand the boom. This is what this movie is going to be about. Check it out. Boom, boom, bam. Check lots of explosions. All of this. And then you watch it and it's like, where is all that? I mean, it's good. Don't get twisted. It, the stuff that they show on Netflix is good. But what they promote on the commercials that draws you into it, it's half of that. And I really have a problem with that. So it's that's... To me, I, I have a problem with that. And Netflix does. Netflix lately has been doing really big amounts, but also I, I didn't have Netflix at first, so it did. But you know, and I know other shows do it, but he, he has his hand raised. But yeah, I don't like it. Yes. Just, just like wondering, child. you were talking about power, right? Just like a child. I'm saying, I, 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 I didn't want to interrupt. I didn't want. I wanted to. He's gonna do it, isn't he? No, no. Yeah. You were talking about power, so I'm wondering the the show power. With James Fox, right? Mm-hmm. And now you, you, you're talking about the how Netflix does the marketing. So, I'm like, what are you trying to? Are you going with what happened in Power, or? Well, I'm. I I, I like Power. I was just ranting on the fact that I don't. <laughs> that what drew me into Power was was what I saw on the commercials, all this extra. But then when I saw the actual movie itself. It wasn't like the commercials made it seem like the movie was going to be a 10 above 10. But when I saw the movie, I would say it's probably an 8. It's not bad. It's good. And the premise of it wasn't at what I thought it was going to be. I thought it was going to be like an, another, another like gritty X-Men, Marvel type Daredevil thing that we can watch. That's going to be something that's going to really be different. But it wasn't necessarily like that. It was just a, to, to give you a summary. It's just about... A person who has powers, who they get powers from in drugs and give it to everybody across the city or the world or whatnot, and then it causes the everybody to, as long as you take the drug, you get these powers, and then one person is trying to get the powers back, 
and and it's a war, drug war, blah blah blah, and it's good, but it wasn't what I thought it was gonna be. I thought it was gonna be a lot more meat to it, and it's good meat. Don't get twisted. It's a, it's a, it's it's like it's a. It's a it's a steak, but it's not a steak from like Outback. It's a steak from like maybe you go to maybe you know um, I don't know uh, uh, Olive like Olive Garden. Olive Garden steaks are okay, but you know Olive Garden steaks ain't Outback steak. So you know it's so it's good. I liked it. it like I said, I liked it. It's good, but like I'm saying, when Netflix do do these marketing ploys, it they really make it seem like something bigger. Another example of it is Warrior Nun. I talked about it before. Worry none, it drew me in with all this. I thought it was gonna be one way and it wasn't. It was a it went a totally different way, not that they way the way I thought it was gonna be. It was still good and I liked it, but it was just not what Netflix did with the marketing. And I understand marketing is supposed to be this. It's just like when I did a commercial for Get Nerdy. Yeah. Get nerdy, this is and everybody like, oh snap, and then they watch and they'll see guys talking, they're like, Oh, I thought it was gonna be like Dad jokes the whole time. No, don't. We, we don't can do it. Jokes. We can do that. No, we don't want dad hey. jokes. But, you know, that's you get, you know what I'm saying. I'm just saying that. You know, what you <laughs> just described, what, what you just described kind of sounded like with the powers, but then mixed in. It sounds like heroes mixed in with like. Like the hood, like the like a like a gangster I mean, aspect. Basically, yeah, it's it's I mean, kind of like that. It's good. You, ever, you watched Static Shock, right? Yes. You remember in Static Shock when the the docks exploded, uh, the the mist went everywhere and gave yeah. people powers. This yeah. was in that area. Yes. Similar to that, but no explosion. Basically, somebody the his the uh, I'm not trying to give anything away, but somebody had power already. Basically, because of military testing, and it kind of passed along to the child, and they had permanent powers, and the, they took that and drug formed it, and they were testing it on the city. They were giving it out hmm. with the, in the drug, and you got five minutes. Whatever you take when you take that pill, that whatever you take the pill, you get a power, and every time you take a pill, that's the same power you get. So. Uh, yeah, you're gonna get the same power every time. So everybody was like, "What's your power?" Some people just exploded. Some people got uh, powers, but <laughs> the body can't handle Sorry. the powers. So it it was all it was was a field test. That's all it was. <laughs> it was the whole city was a field test, and that's messed up. It's kind of like some stuff somebody would actually do, like they would release that shit on the public. I wouldn't. Yeah. Doubt. I do. I agree with Domingo. Like it wasn't what I thought it was going to be, but That's it was still good. It was still really good. Yeah, it was really uh, good. Yeah. I I was very disappointed at the ending. That, uh, yeah, a lot of people said that. A lot of people said that. We're not going to talk about that though. But he power is like it's like really that's it. Uh huh. Mm, All right. Lackluster yeah. endings. I don't like that. Yeah, it was a little yeah. lackluster. It was like. Yeah. But um, anyway, but so but but another goes. another thing that's that's good though about about that and like I said, marketing is you know we live with with the COVID world. I probably wouldn't have noticed it. Maybe it was post post pre 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 COVID because I noticed some of that in some of the movies and stuff pre COVID, like Batman v Superman. Let's not talk about that. But you know, but even still, you know, I I didn't. You know, I didn't, I'm noticing it a lot more, maybe because I'm at home. Hey, that's not what you said. Oh, that's pretty good, whatever. But at the same time, you know, I think we still need these little movies, even though they're not gigantic blockbusters and crazy, because, you know, we still need stuff to watch over and over and over, especially otherwise you'd be, you know, watching everything or hating everything or whatever. So I think it's good. Speaking of other movies, um, Tenet just came out. Um, IGN, um, uh, well, what is it? I think Film Herald and some others did the review on it. And it's a good movie. They say that it's not Christopher Nolan's big thing. Christopher Nolan decided to go on a safer safer route. Um, think of mixing a little, a little bit of Inception with <clears throat> some some of the uh, Dark Knight, a little bit of the Dark Knight and some crime and like some crime spy drama stuff and you get um, Tenet. But it's very good. You know, Christopher Nolan is very good about taking 
some kind of idea like time or dreams or Batman and then just making it like fit in the real world and making it gritty and good. So yeah, it's, it's, it's supposed, I'm, I am actually want to go see it now. Apparently movie theaters are open. I've missed that. Maybe, I don't know how. And so now I kind of want to go see that movie because apparently it's good. A lot of people gave it like eights and nines. They say it's not his masterpiece. Cause you know, I think they think a lot of people say that Christopher Nolan's masterpieces are some people argue interstellar. I still say dark Knight is one of my favorites. Some people like, Inception better, so it's all you know. Depends on where you fall with Christopher Nolan. A lot of people like more of the sci-fi stuff. I still think Dark Knight is probably one of his, his um, the second one is still one of his best of and of, of one of his movies or whatever. Um, but yeah, so um, that movie's good. Go check it out. And if you had, don't know, DC Fandom came out. They actually did a lot more game stuff, so I'm gonna leave that and raise hands later. But um, if you don't know. They talked about the Snyder Cut. They talked about different things coming up. Um, uh, so just be ready for that. Like I said, they did a lot more games and cartoon stuff, so I don't want to divulge too much into that. But what I am going to talk about is if you ever seen this show called Supernatural with Jensen, and you know this guy named Jensen Ackles. Um, I saw this. Uh, the Boys, which is on Amazon, which I think, I think if it hasn't already aired, it's getting ready to air. They've already been, they've already got approved for season three. It's crazy how streaming works. And he is approved to play somebody on there, somebody very important that's supposed to be a parody of Captain America. So I think that's gonna be dope. So. Warrior none got uh, approved for season two. Oh, season two. Ah, there you go. Warrior none. And look, there you go. I'm actually excited about that because because the guy said. The guy said the reason why he did it like the way he did is because he said that if he keeps going with it, there's a lot more lore and things to it. I'm not sure if this is a comic or something that he created himself, but regardless, he said the lore is supposed to be way bigger than those, what, how many episodes were it? 12, 24? But, yeah, so that's all I got for this week. The news week was kind of slow. I mean, there are some little tidbits here and there, but... Not nothing, anything that's really, really major that I wanted to kind of hit into. So I just kind of wanted to kind of watch some things, find out <clears throat> some stuff, whatever. Um, uh, oh, uh, this is on some cartoon stuff. I wanted to say it. Um, just a little small rant, last rant for Domingo before I send it over to Ray. I saw the killing joke. It was okay. Saying it's okay because, of course, the comic was better and the movie was good. But I just didn't like I, animation style. I prefer. Um, everybody knows my favorite. My favorite um, DC movie is still the Mask of the Phantasm. Sorry, I love that movie as far as the old style of the Batman animated series, the old Joker and all that. I thought the origin story of that is better. The Killing Joke was okay. I didn't really buy the Joker's origin story. It was okay. I, I mean, I felt like they use that in the actual regular movie, The Joker. But the rant is pretty much for, does anybody know what the actual canon of Batman is? I mean, they say Oracle is canon because she got her legs shot. But you got the Batman Beyond verse where she got her legs. And then you got one where she didn't have sex with Batman, and that's supposed to be canon, but then she didn't. Then it's the multiverse. So what it's multiverse all, is not the multiverse? Which multiverse is my verse? Bruh, I want to know bruh, Batman animated series, bruh, bruh, what's mine? Bruh, I'm sorry. Bruh, I just got a little set there. I'm okay. Bruh, <laughs> not like, okay. You, one thing you got to know about DC and Marvel, it's all canon. It's yeah, the multiverse. Just, That's they it. They find a way to do it. But the multiverse is like every the story, Every story is canon yep. to that story. Yep. The, the that's just how it is. List it, put in the list that's for the Batmans for me. That's just how it is. Know. Yep. That's just how it is in the Marvel and DC. This universe. It's multiverse. Yeah. They can it, come it, up with, they can pull out anything. They can say that uh, Clark Kent is Batman. Yep. Multiverse. You know, you said that it might be, I can't confirm it, but maybe already something out there where it is like that. It was like a what if Clark Kent was Batman instead of Superman. 
Actually, like, I think they already exist. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> it might exist already. And I know I saw some some awesome artwork of uh, somebody did, they they flip-flopped DC and Marvel characters from the movies. So they had like Chris Evans as Batman and Ben Affleck as Captain America. Yeah. They did a, no, 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 Ben Affleck was uh, was Iron Man. And then, yeah, yeah Man. and then Tony, uh, Tony Stark, I think. See, it, it's ingrained in my brain. Robert Downey Jr. was the Batman. Yeah, it, it was, there was several other ones. Chris, uh, Chris Hemsworth as Aquaman was a little bit weird, but I could totally believe Jason Momoa as, as freaking Thor, though. He had the beard, yeah. and he looked like, he did look like a version yeah. for, like, from a comic. No bullshit. Yeah, that like, would have been, he would have yeah. yeah, but, yeah, he's right. The, the multiverse is a scapegoat on all of that every time. Every time. You might as well just blame the multiverse. Blame the idea of the multiverse for all of that you just ran into. Huh. What you're saying is, there's a multiverse where I'm tall, and there's no COVID-19. <laughs> you did okay, that with yourself. It. You do hey, know that your man is on the I screen. know. I know, but I'm with it. I'm with it. If, there's, of, he, if he of, exists. Speaking of the multiverse, and like this is a question, you know, that's just as dumbfounding as this, as that. You know, like it's just, you know, I, if the stork is the oh, bird... Wow. <laughs> if the stork is the bird that delivers babies, what is the bird that prevents babies? What? I'm, I, know, I heard what you say. I'm saying what because what kind of question is that? I don't know. It's like what? Raven? <laughs> huh? a, a raven? No, no, no. Oh, this is I'm so, really trying to answer it. Look at me. What am I doing? <laughs> <laughs> See, I told you, it's just as like perplexing. I'm really trying to answer it. Right? What am I doing? Okay, so this is a weird right? segue into gaming, right? but we're going right? to move on to gaming. No. I will mute you. <laughs> now you you mute me. Raven is a part of Teen Titans. Teen Titans was an amazing game. You are prolonging this. You are prolonging this. Answer I don't have an answer to this. If if the stork brings the babies, what the what? Line? Keeps the babies from. Coming. The I don't. Baby. I don't know. I mean, Mingo had a good one, but no, that's not it. It's the swallow. <laughs> wow. You know what? That one was just cheesy. That one was good. That one was good. <laughs> I I'm with that one. I'm. That's going in the mental roller decks. I'm keeping <laughs> it. That is funny. I, I don't, I don't think, think you. Can, I don't All think that that was not a dad joke. But it's so, not a dad joke. It's definitely not a dad joke. But definitely that one, do not please, tell your kids that, that one was please. funny. That one was funny. Please I can get on board. With that. I, you know and what? He's be careful some, telling your wives people. that people. Yeah, I'm not gonna tell them. They won't know about that. It's not, it's not a wife. I mean, she might have heard it because I'm pretty sure she's in there while you know recording. They this. wouldn't know nothing. But about the you know, it, yet and still, that was actually. That was decent. You get points for that one. I'm not gonna get on you. I'm not gonna get on you about that one. Yeah, I'm sure at some point you are gonna drop some in here, and I'm gonna have to. Yeah. Oh, it's but coming. Anyway. Just go, go keep rolling. He, anyway, anyway, anyway. So yeah, gaming, yeah. my section. That was a weird segue, but we're that was on to gaming. Horrible segue. I, <laughs> <laughs> very horrible. No, uh, I promised you guys last week uh, some cyberpunk talk because. Um, that game is coming out November 6th, November 6th, November the 9th, one of the two. Um, of course, I didn't write it down on my notes, but it is in November 2020. It is coming out and it will be out in 2021. Uh, no exact date uh, for Xbox One or what they call it, Xbox Series X. Um, but it's going to be able to be played in first or third person. It's an RPG. It's going to be open world, completely it's an open world RPG. It has a story, but it's open world. And the way it describes, the way it reads, it almost feels like GTA, but expanded, to be fair. Because there's vehicles, there's, you know, tons of vehicles. And the character, though, is completely customizable. Like, you can make your character everything. He has a na his name is V for the story, but you can create he or she. Let me say that, because there's male or female. Um, you create them and you can make them however you want to make them. Like you can have like a robotic arm. You can have, you know, be completely human, but except for this side of your face. I mean, the way it looks, the way it reads is completely customizable. 
um, and it's going to have a stat, a stat category thing based off of character classes. So when you create the character, you can choose a class and uh, the different classes, I had to write them down because there's different ones. Um, some of the different classes are what they call a net runner, which is like a hacker, uh, a techie, which is a person that's into machinery, you know, whether it be modifications to the body or like building machinery to do things. Um, and then uh, an interesting one was called Solo, which is a combat character. So this person is going to be kind of like your badass, you know, they can hands on, like, you know, put up your dudes, fight, martial arts, different, you know, different things um, as far as combat, weapons as well. Um, so you have those different archetypes, and then you have perk trees based off of the archetypes. So as you play along, you can unlock different perks by doing different missions, doing so many things, kind of like doing repetitive things. Not, let me not say repetitive. I'm sure some of it is repetitive, but the more you do certain things, you can kind of steer your character into that direction. So if you want a character based off of like melee, like just straight up, I'm going to put these hands on you. You can build it that way by using the melee more than using, say, a gun. And you'll unlock different things within that perk tree to fit the melee. Um, they have the different perk trees. You can have melee. There's tons of them. I only wrote down a few. There's the melee, like I mentioned, blades, um, melee blades, rifles, uh, shotguns, handguns, sniper rifles. Oh. Um, knives i think i said the blades i mean there's tons of different things that you can choose to make your character good at you can pick and choose um like i mentioned it's open world so you'll you'll have your missions um the the main premise of the game is in a place um in the future is 2077 um it's called a place called night city north california so apparently california is split up into i guess north and south and this place particularly is north california and it has six regions. Um, I didn't write down all of them. Um, they're, they're different regions with different classes of people. Um, you have your, you know, your suburbs, you have your corporate area, you have your you know, rich, the luxurious. You have places where there's people that, are, are, that live on the streets. They, you know, they said hom homelessness is abundant whenever you walk around the streets of this place. Um, all different wow. regions, all different uh, um, types of people, all different interactions. They said that interactions are gonna be key in the game. You, you get a different interaction with a different person. You won't have the same rhetorical and the same repetitive conversations. It, it varies amongst all the people. Huh. Kind of like a lot of watchdogs that they announced where it's like everybody is a playable character and everybody is different. This is kind of playing off of that same thing. Everybody's different. Everybody has a backstory. Everybody does different things. Your interaction will be different. Um, the environments will be different based off of where you are and what you've done and what you haven't done as far as um, your character. So if you've done a lot of illegal things, if you go to a part of the, 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 a part of the city that's um, more corporate based with more security, the security will recognize you and it may be oh. more difficult for you to move around and wow. do things, yeah, and do things because they know you've done these other things and they're gonna be watching you. Whereas like, in places uh, where there's more crime, you may be able to get rid of, you know, get away with things because you might have people there that are that are with your cause that help you and help keep you, you know, kind of under close guidance and away from the cops. Like um, interesting. Creed. Oh, go ahead. Like kind of. Kind of like Assassin's Creed. And interesting enough, in the game, it says that people, uh, regular people, are armed at more times because of the... Uh, they have a police force, and I, I didn't write it down, but they're basically the police force is ran by the government and the military, and they're kind of they're kind of tyrants, and so like average people on the street have are strapped. Like you might run into somebody that doesn't have a home, but they got guns and shit. Oh, so it's like Texas. <laughs> so it's like what? So it's like Texas. Kind of, yeah. You can say that. <laughs> Everybody got a gun here. You have to be right about that. So, um, see, it's pretty cool. Um, it's a living changing environment, day-night cycle, um, a la GTA and a few other open world games. Um, game over only occurs in death. So if you fail a mission, it just tells you you failed, the world keeps moving. And the fact that you failed the mission or the fact that you passed the mission or the way you passed the mission or failed the mission 
affects what happens after. So everything you do has a consequence and it changes gameplay, wow. it changes story, it changes basically the, the, the reaction of the world, even to you, it changes it. So it's a very interesting like game. It. Um, it, it's something that I, I think that everybody should check out. I'm gonna definitely check out when it comes out. Um, I said November 6th is the date that it's releasing. Um, sounds like a lot of fun and you know it sounds like a good mix of like gta assassin's creed like he said um some watchdogs it's got all of that and the dopest thing you know voice actors keanu reeves is a main character and who, who doesn't want neo or whatever you want to call him he's always in badass movies you know what, what who doesn't want keanu reeves i mean be serious you know he's voice acting one of the main like He's voice acting the character that has the most dialogue besides your character. So you get a whole lot of Keanu Reeves in this game. And uh, this character looks just like him, just with a metal arm. His name's Johnny Silver Arm or Silver Hands. That's what they call him, Johnny Silver Hands. So there's that too. So definitely something to check out. Um, uh, it does have multiplayer uh, online. It has online multiplayer. So uh, you'll be able to take your character online and do this, a lot of this stuff which I think is dope. I mean, you want to be able to play with people, you know, and not just, I know what you're trying to do there. You tried that. I caught it. You know, I'm just what? playing with people. Uh, I said it before I even thought about it. Anyway, anyway, wait, definitely wait. want to check out online. I'm not what? going back. I'm not going back. What? Okay. Oh, oh wait a so, minute. So, so, you can't just, you can't I, accuse I, me I'll of something. You don't even know. I, I'll throw it out there. I said, yes, you'll be able to play with people i didn't say play this game with people and that could have turned into a thing that's why domingo is looking like that because he heard it and he was waiting on you okay but i wasn't, even, like, you, I wasn't you, even going there i just wanted to know if it was multiplayer so yeah i said i'm getting it uh ladies and gentlemen took it to the sexual ladies and gentlemen this man is don't let him con you anyway so that's cyberpunk that is definitely cyberpunk I will never. And, uh it was lead to my, my next uh, next game I wanted to talk about. Um, it's definitely already been out, um, but huge, huge update coming, and this will feed kind of into what Mr. Snake is going to talk about when he gets there, whichever side is free he's on. Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2. Super big, free. Free is the key word, update. Massive free update. Um, April, uh, August the 26th. Keep that in mind, August 26th, we get this update. Su the Supreme Kai of Time, or Kroanoa, that's her name. I did not know that. I just thought I'd throw that out there. Really? You didn't know yes. that? Yes. I did not know that was her name. I just always call her Supreme Kai of Time. Yeah, I, you know, I, that's a, that's a hit of nerdiness, <laughs> but I had no idea. So she's going to be a playable character now, which I think is pretty dope. Oh, wow. And uh, she, of course, she'll come with extra missions, uh, uh, Parallel Quest. They've verified that um, her move set will be a part of the move sets that uh, the moves that we get, the, the skills that we get to be able to add to our CACs. And uh, on top of all that, because she, she's got her four or five moves that we'll be able to use. Um, on top of all that, we're getting a whole lot more moves, including well, let me if I say moves, we're getting a whole lot more moves, but we are getting Ultra Instinct for CACs. I don't know how I feel. I, I'm excited and I'm kind of afraid at the same time. And, and more so, if you play online and you fight people online, this could be either really good or it can be really bad. Because in theory, Ultra Instinct anything is absolutely overpowered. It's OP. Man, trying to fight Goku yeah, Ultra Instinct? Fight, yeah. Oh Goku, on that game, when they released Goku Ultra Instinct, it was absolutely ridiculous trying to beat Goku. The only way you can attack him is with energy attacks. Yeah, you can't punch him. So I, I'm i sure they're going to do something to try to nerf it. Like, you can't just... I, I'm going to use it, but yeah. I hope they don't just like throw it on. Oh, here you go. Now they can't punch you. And it's like, dude, really? Like You have a whole, have a whole team, like one of the P player versus player. Yeah. And all every, all yeah. six they're just like Yeah, just like there's no hours they're, they're, just yeah, they're just punching but nobody's getting hit. Like, hours I, just on and on, on and on. Like I, I don't see it. I think they're gonna nerf it. Maybe they'll have it a way where you can dodge maybe the first two or three hits and then afterwards it's like you're an idiot. You, you uh, are a bro, jackass and a half. No, I just I just thought <laughs> like 
you can have have the fight going on and on, and then edit it, edit a song in. This is the song that never. Yeah, you could do that. You're right. It would be like that. It would. But I think they're gonna have something to nerf it. I, I'm guessing you can you can dodge the first two or three because they have that the uh, deal, and I have it on one of my characters or one of my builds. Um, yeah, that uh, whenever we're playing, that uh, was it data the data input. Yeah. And you can use it, and you know until it runs out, you you stand there and they can punch all day long, kick, and they yeah. cannot hit you. But it runs out, and then you have to wait so, before you can use it again. So with what I'm trying, what I'm thinking, I don't know yet how they're gonna do it because you know every every transformation has a down has a downfall. Yeah. Like yeah. whenever they came out with blue, like the only yeah. way to yeah. actually use it, you have to use a Z soul to balance it out. Yeah, because it zaps your, uh, your, your key. Like yeah, your key it key uses gone. key, and then certain other ones use different, you know, like set amount of key or something. Uh, I'm thinking that this will use up your stamina bar. Yeah, and... Because... So, that's like, what, K.O. Ken. Yeah. Yeah, exactly like, uh, like because... Yeah. I think it might they might they might use it like a KO can like you can only use it like sporadic like I don't think you which, can just transform which would be fair because you know in the anime I mean he uses it but it you know every time he's used it so far is it's limited is for a certain amount yeah. of time and when it shuts down when it shuts off he's he's damn they're done it's like yeah like he's, he I hasn't can't mastered it yet like yeah he, so and it's not they didn't say it was mastered over uh -huh. just get ultra instinct so. They're adding that, but I think, I, I hope, because the, there's also new Super Souls. There's 13 new Super Souls included in this pack. This this update is huge, and it's free. So there's 13 new Super Souls, so, which makes it scary, too, because then they're going to have some Super Soul that, like, buffs your fucking stamina. <laughs> so ultimate then, cheering. Yeah, so then <laughs> you buff your stamina, and you're using Ultra Instinct. I know what How we're talking about next week. Yeah. Ultimate Broly. Because yeah. it 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 if it's like this, I'm gonna be like, listen, y'all need to go back in and tone that shit down because that is too much. Like you next week, next week we will have the breakdown for it because it comes out next Wednesday. We'll be playing it Wednesday, yep. it Thursday, Friday, and, yep. and I'll have you whatever. So I got three days to tell you whether yeah. it's going to happen. Because I'm gonna definitely get it and unlock everything and and put on my character and try it out because I gotta know. Um, what about stacks? What about like where well, you can stack this or stack that or stack this? To that's kinda... the thing with the with the Super Souls and the QQ. Bang. Oh, there's new QQ bangs too. There is a six star. There are six star six QQ stars. bangs. Yeah. Yes. I, I don't know what they are. They did not say. I just know that there are six star QQ bangs now, which again makes me kind of afraid that you can get some jackass that... <laughs> plays this game relentlessly and he's going to figure out how to mix this fucking QQ bang and he's going to run around Ultra Instinct all game. So, yeah, he would be that He would be that person. He'll figure out how to do it. And then now we'll have to deal with Goku. But we also get, like I said, there's new uh, I'm trying to hurry because we're going to get into a whole lot more Dragon Ball. But um, there's also the new uh, the new skills. There's like 19 or there's a absurd amount of skills that go along with from the spring card time and then other moves. They're giving us the godly, uh, godly display. You can now put that on your character. Um, it was the, it's one of the big Super Bowl, kind of like uh, Freeze's version of the big Super Bowl that he has that he does his finger. Okay, it's the godly display one that you got from, is it Goku that does it? It looks like a big spirit ball, but it was in like Ultra Instinct. It was white. I can't think who it is. No, no, no. It's uh, uh, uh from Goku Black, freaking Zamasu. He mm. had the, the, the godly display, or he, he called it something different, the divinity or divine display, whatever it was, had a big old ass like Super Bowl that came down and hit. Anyway, you're getting that move, and we're getting a new Kamehameha, and they're adding it to the Ultra Instinct Goku that's already in the game. It's going to be the fucking sliding Kamehameha. And, uh, and you know what I'm minute. talking about. Yes. I, when I saw that, I said, yep, put that on my character because I'm going to slide and bust somebody's oh, face. Gonna face work. In there. I'm sure it's an animated thing. Like, it's probably something it, you're going to have to catch. I bet you anything. I bet you anything. That's going to be a hard one to get off. Ha uh, 
it it it, obviously is the ultimate um, it's i think i bet you anything that's going to be to where you have it's going to be a counter probably because i bet you anything like just like hit like hit has that one you can only use it as a counter and it's strong as hell yeah but it's hard it will hit you hard as hell but it's hard to have to time it right i bet you anything you have to. You can only. You're only gonna be able to use that when somebody's like shooting a beam at you. Like if somebody, yeah. you see somebody doing it. Like if you hit it right at the good time, and then he'll do, do it. it. I bet which, you anything. Which is fair. You. Which is fair because then you get the animation, and you know, I hope, I hope they do like they did in the Tournament of Power, because that made that move like even more. Like I remember the first time I watched it and I saw the whole like, they did like the triple or quadruple like. Whenever he actually shot it, it was like, ah, I hope it does it. I, yeah. I'm with you. I hope it does it because like three different I'll probably angles. get up and like turn yeah. my whole Xbox off. Like, I'm the motherfucking man. I just hit that. I'm out. I ain't got like to do three different angles. Like, just Brain like, capture. Bam, bam, man. Yeah. Bam, bam. Yeah. If I hit that move and like end the game, I'm like, all right, bro, I'm going to bed. I'm good. Hey, I did it. Can you imagine, can you imagine they add that into the, uh, the team one, the yeah, dope. That, yeah, the that, would dope. that would be dope. That would be dope. That that's unfair, but it would be dope. It'd be dope. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't gonna lie to you. That would be dope. Oh, they're adding also, and this is the last thing, and then we're gonna go to Snake because he's got tons of stuff. They're also adding in this update. There's going to be uh, new three versus three battles. So, you know how we do parallel quests, and it's like usually me, you, and Kaza. Yeah. Of course, just for example, and we play against the computer three, you know, us three against whatever they got going on. Well, apparently there's new battles now where you can take three people against three other people, and it's going to be some kind of team-based thing. They've already, it's they've already it, had that though. Well, but they're they're tweaking it and they're making it as some different things about it, and it's not tournament-based. Oh, so it's not versus. No, it's versus, but it's just not tournament-based. It's not just like. You go to like do the tournament, like you, you know the tournament arena where you're in the ring and you do the stuff and you fight. This yeah. is something totally different. It's it's almost like you can just challenge people, like open world challenge, just do it, and it's like three people versus three people, and you that's, fight. That's what I'm talking about. Right, but that's what I'm talking I, about. They already have that. There's something they're changing about it. I don't. It didn't go into detail. It just brought up about the three v three. Because they have they have the tournament that you they only the tournament only happens certain right it's, like, those are certain events. times like they're, they're scheduled yeah. but yeah. they you can go over and you can actually choose like a versus battle and you can do one on one or you can do three on three right well this I, this there's something different about this they there wasn't a lot of detail on it when I when I was researching it's just it, it the three on three cool, battle do what would be cool if they did a three versus three like uh versus but like you're doing the actual mission so you're going through the mission versing three like so whoever does the mission first right and it may be that may be what it is they just it didn't it wasn't clear but there's going to be a change to it where it's something they're adding to the three versus three so that's that's a thing too and uh so this the update and there's, there's still more that i didn't even talk about because there's, I mean, you know, you got the, what is that game that you get that we got where you go up and play with the little characters? There's like, oh, yeah, the, uh, there's like, Cobbs is, that Cobbs is going to kick out of that if he, if he had yeah, more there, that. There's like 19 new characters or versions of characters. They, in that. I mean, what they added, Domingo, is it's a, it's, it's a, the Coliseum. And yeah, that's pretty it. much Coliseum. Yeah, Hero Coliseum. Yeah, it's Hero Coliseum. It's pretty much a uh, Yu Gi Oh battle. Which, yeah. Yeah. Like they they got figurines. You can get different figurines of all these different people, and they yeah. have, you can set up a certain amount. You can set up three at a time, and depending on what their stats are and when they can go and all that stuff, and it battles. Yep. So, ah, cool. So they they added some more characters to that and uh, versions of characters to that. So that's another part of it. And like I said, there's tons of it. I'm not gonna keep going because there's there's it's it's a huge huge update and it's completely free uh, i you know i kind of applaud bandai i was wondering how come it took so long but the fact that they're adding you know ui you know 
they're adding additions to UI Goku. They're adding all his moves, you know, all these different abilities and moves and QQ bangs and super souls and all this stuff. Like it makes sense now why it took so long. Cause that's even with paid, I think this is bigger than any paid that we've ever gotten. Usually with paid, you get two characters, but you don't get this many moves and QQ bangs, all this stuff. You don't get all this other stuff. So it's definitely, definitely something that I'm going to be playing. I know Snake's going to play it. We might even get, you know, if we can sneak Mingo on the, on the Xbox. I mean, we can just sneak him on there one time. Just one time just to check it out. That way we could all, like, talk well, about it. Well. But who knows? But I'm going to shoot it on over to, to Mr. Snake, whichever side of the screen he's on, because we're, we're on Dragon Ball. I know this man has Dragon Ball news. I know he does. While well, we got Domingo in the suit. So, Why Mr. Snake. Video. He's in the like, suit. Bro. He's in the suit. We got to well, see Mingo. With I don't even think that pops plan. up on the video. Like it just, like whenever y'all do that, like it just like shoots oh, down to that's... just the two of us. So did we but, lose so need to see No, he's there. I can hear him. I can hear him at first. What's that? Got it. Told you. Bam. He had to go get the snacks. Yeah. I mean, you could just get up. You don't have to stop your video. Hey, Brad, he, maybe he, maybe that man ain't wearing no pants or something. You don't know. Uh, I'm thinking of a man. Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> what does a man in a garden have in common? A man, a man in a garden? A woman. No. Mm. No. A man in a garden. Grounded with them freaking spiders. I hate them. Ha, no. I don't know. I, I, I give. Everything I can They both get plowed by a hoe. <laughs> I knew it had something to do with a hoe. I, I was trying to figure out how the hoe fit. <laughs> I was trying to figure that out. I just didn't know how to make that work. That's... You know, we want children to watch this, and you just keep on. Do we? I always check. I mean, always check the option is not for children. Yeah. Okay. Thank you, because th this is not children safe at all. Why are we talking about holes and garden tool holes and all kinds of weird stuff? Anyway, anime, Dragon Ball, take it away with your right. weird jokes. Anyway, I, I got one more left. Anyway. Oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Them All right, so, cool. Anytime so you have a lot to cover. Like uh, uh, <laughs> I, I'm going to ramble them off because there was a lot. Uh, so here's something you want to talk about. Cashews. Huh? You hmm? said the snacks was Cash. good. Anyway, go ahead. Cashews. You eating cashews, bro. Yes. Nuts. I knew you was going to say it. Nuts. So I'm just telling you. Nuts. That's now cashews aren't nuts. They're not fruit. They're sad. They're not nuts. I say they're cashews. The fuck? <laughs> uh, anyway, uh, uh, just come on, Dragon Ball. Come on, come on, Dragon Ball. Uh, okay. Yeah, Dragon Ball, bro. Come on, Dragon Ball. Uh, okay. <laughs> All right, I got a lot. Uh, first off, first off. Uh, I kind of want to run through the the, uh, the Dragon Ball, the latest update for the Dragon Ball uh, Chapter sixty three in the manga. Uh, oh, the, they they had, got the finished version. Uh, no more spoilers. So, long story short, basically, uh, Miris was fighting Moru. Uh, he teleported everybody away with the help of Weep, uh, and then they healed him. Uh, then they healed Goku first. He found out that Miris was fighting Moru, so he he thanked Dende and jetted over to the battle. You know, that's in true Goku fashion. Uh, I don't know if they're gonna keep the scar of where he, you know, because he had uh, he had his hole in his freaking chest, and then they healed him. They have like a little round scar type thing on his shoulder, on his pectoral. Even on his back, so I don't know if they're going to keep that going forward. 
but it kind of makes you think like all the times he's died, like he should have multiple fucking scars. It's true. But Central being. So that's what I'm saying. Like, so I don't know if the Central being healed scars too, or and this is this was Dende healing him. So does is the scar going to always be there? You know, from going forward. That's just be, that's a side that note. That could be the limit of Dende, yeah. Yeah, that's a side yeah, note. So it's something to think about. If they're gonna if I'm gonna be looking for that in every time he gets his shirt ripped off. But so uh, whenever he gets to the battle, because he, he knows that Maris is an angel, and if an angel fights with his angel powers, they disappear. So he run. He went to the battle, and he was like begging Maris to stop because he's going to disappear. So the whole time when he's fighting Moro, like uh, Moro didn't know, you know, who, you know, what he's doing, what the, who he is. He can't sense a presence, you know, like his sense is more divine. He keeps talking to him too. So, you know, he messed him up. Last time I talked about it, like he messed him with, with the pole. Uh, like a power pole thing that he had. Uh, so after that, like he, Moro kind of sensed that his, his power is on a divine level, you know, and then Mary's just smirked. Um, so the whole time Jocko's there off to the side, just dumbfounded, like always. Um, <laughs> but... So whenever Go he Mirrors got there, I mean Goku got there and Mirrors was talking to him, uh Goku was trying to stop him. Moro tried to he used Piccolo's ability and went underground with his hand and tried to get the back of his head, uh, to get his power, but at that time he summoned his angel staff and cut off his hand behind him. That was like quick. So he used that staff. So now he's using his angel powers, like he's slowly uh. getting, yeah, so so then Mary's like, okay, those, uh, the stones on his hand and then on his forehead, those are a problem. And he's like, okay, I got to steal them. So uh, Moru got his hand back, you know, and started to, went to attack. Mary's like pushed him down, like with this like gravity attack on the ground. Moro was just like freaking out, he's like, what the hell? Uh, well, at that time, his palm was like facing up, and he came down with his staff and used to point it in and right into this, uh, on one of the stones and broke it. Um, then Moro got up and still trying to fight. And the way Maris is smooth, bro, like with his staff, like he like dives into stuff, like, and he positioned his staff just right and flicked Moro up in the air. <laughs> Uh, and while Moro was up in the air, he's like freaking out again, and his palm went up like on the instinct type. And at that moment, Mirrors used his staff like a rifle and blasted his energy at the other one and broke that one. Uh, so then Mar uh, Moro was like away from him, and Mar the whole time Goku, when Goku's there, he's begging him to stop. And he even tried, he, you know, he's back to normal. So he, he tried going, uh, Omni, uh, Ultra Instinct, trying to fight Moro, Moro again. And Moro just like punched him away one, one hit. And, uh, Mary. Oh, wait. Was, and Ultra Instinct. Yeah. Ultra Instinct cannot, Ultra Instinct Omen cannot hold a candle to Moro right now. Right. But he, he doesn't have Ultra Instinct Master. Right, it's the it's the uh, unmastered version. So That's why. Moro's just beat, Moro's like, that didn't beat me a while last time. Because he punched a hole through him while he was in the same state. So he's like, that didn't work on me last time. Why do you think it's going to be different? So Goku's like, he's like mad that it's not working. He taught me, he was telling Maris that he gave me all this uh, time and I uh, still don't have it down, but more Maris is like, no, you just need an extra push. And so this is where he gets Maris sacrifices and stuff. Yeah. So it uh, basically he Goku's back, so he uh, he powers up all the way. Like he powers up, his halo ring comes up. Uh, as angel ring 
and he freaking charges directly at Moro. Moro sees him, and he like throws the energy blast at him. You know, like kind of how Frieza does, like mm-hmm. throws it down real fast. He mirrors went right through the energy blast like it wasn't even there. Uh, and at that time, like Moro saw it, he, so he threw his hands up to do a bigger one. But it was too late. Like, Maris was already right there in his face. And all his power, he put all his power in the punch and punched him right in his forehead and broke that, that last crystal in his forehead and sent him flying. Like, the so Moro is down and kind of hurt because he's got all the crystals broken. He can't absorb nobody no more. Uh, now, I don't know if they throw a curveball in there that the healing regeneration where they would heal it. I don't know, but apparently these are this is supposed to be the way marriage is sealing those those that power. So but he put all his force into that. And then once he went away, then he started like disappearing like on a uh he's just fading away like like dirt. Like dust. Kind of like Iron Man at the end of well, Iron Man didn't do it, but it's a snap. Yes. Um, <laughs> so at that point, he looked back at Goku and he's like telling him, like, you know, they they're doing a flashback the whole time, saying, you know, he he's been the whole time he's there, he's an angel, he's only supposed to observe, and the whole time he's working as a patrol, the Galactic Patrolman, he got this sense of justice, he loves he loves this galaxy, so he wants to protect it. He told Goku. This is your time. Protect this galaxy that I love, and all of a sudden, you know, happy stuff. Uh, so then he fades away right in front, and Beerus and we came back too, and they so they see him disappear. The last frame shows Goku like standing with his back turned. He's looking down, and you see there's an aura around it. So he's. Basically, if you think about it, if you think back, it, it's kind of like what happened when it's a, uh, like when he turned Super Saiyan the first time. I knew it. It's like a um, homage, pretty much, to those. You know, like, the, it, or Gohan when he turned Super Saiyan. It's always a trigger. Always a trigger to get to that next level. Always. So... That, and that's what it is. It's like that's what Mirrors knew too. And he said you just need that last push. And this is the last push. So the next episode, he is about to go down. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I don't think there's anything um, scarier than like a pissed off Goku. Like yeah, he, that over and over again. When you finally, it takes forever because he played too goddamn much. I say that all the time. He always bullshitting, but another to do piss him another off. thing. Another thing is though that they, they might they might do a switch up. They might do a switch up and might do what they did in uh, the Frieza movie, Turn it, Revenge of Frieza. They might do a switch up, and we might think it's Goku. You know how Vegeta came in and then Goku finished it. They might switch it up. Goku's in there, and we think it's Goku, and Vegeta comes in and finishes it. So. It's, yeah, a, it's still a kind of a this, this weaker this weaker moral it would kind of build uh, you know what I, and I'd still be happy for it because I still say Vegeta deserves a moment he should yeah, have already so had it, a moment it could go it could go a lot of ways there's a lot of theories out there right now like there's a lot of, uh, from what might happen in the next one but we know this is going to push him to the master of ultra uh, so that's going to be dope which is and whenever this gets into whenever this gets into the animated for the for the show, it's freaking awesome. This is gonna all this is gonna be awesome. This entire freaking Moro's season is gonna Misaga. be awesome. I can't yeah. wait. Cause yeah, the manga yeah. the manga is one thing and the mangas are always better. Always better than animated. But seeing it in yeah. action is what is awesome. I agree. But, so that's that's the the, the, the thing. Uh, I know that I rambled on about about that. I, knew that. I kinda knew that was gonna take a while. So all these other ones are kinda I'm not gonna go into too much detail. If you wanna ask about them, yeah, we can talk about it. But so 
along with that, uh, Funimation is going to be actually releasing Dragon Ball Z again on the set. For the 28th time. 14, it's been 14 times. Not only nine have been completed. So I don't know if this is actually going to be a complete set. But it's like the new steel books. Apparently, uh, the, the fandom is actually kind of upset about it because they actually use the same detailing on this one mm. as they did the last one. <laughs> so it's kind of like redo. You know, it's one of those so, things like as a nerd, you kind of, I ain't going to lie, if I called it at the right price, I'd probably, just because it's the steel book, and it's probably going to have right. nice steel case, cases to everything, I'd probably get it. I'm not going to lie. Like, I, I don't need it because I don't need it, but it's, it looks good. So you're going to have people that are going to buy it. It's just how it is. Yeah, I'm going to run, run this through again. again. Save your questions to the end of the show. Uh, <laughs> uh, all right, second, uh, Kissimmee went down. It's a famous site. If you use Kissimmee, they are down. But right now, it is actually saying that it's permanent shutdown. They're mm. cracking down on the pirating. Uh, along with that, there is a game changer that's coming to the anime, and it is free anime. On YouTube, the YouTube channel that they're coming out with. Right now, it's only in Japan, so you can't get, you can't have access to it now. But they are working on this. It is a YouTube channel. It's called Anime Log, and it's got the most. It's like uh, basically it's the Japan's top studios combined to launch YouTube's channel to stream free anime. Mm. Uh, it's Toei Animation. Kadashi, uh, Nimpo, uh, or Nimpa, I can't, anyway, and then there's a few other ones. Like, they're all, mm. so since Kisame, you know, like, they're all having, basically what was going on is they're all having this issue with pirating. So they're like, okay, pirating is actually working. You know, people actually like watching. They go there because that's the only way they can watch it. So they they know that. So they're going to put it together to where they, they're beating the pirating. If it's already free, then the pirating can't do it. True. So there, all of the all of them are coming together, and there's like three thousand titles that they're going to be show, having to where, and it's like all the originals. Like if they're already, you know, if some of them like Crunchyroll and stuff like that are already set, then those are going to be on Crunchyroll and stuff like that. So they are going to be streaming. They're probably going to be having some ads. That are going to be running on the uh, YouTube, but also YouTube is going to be having the you know like the uh, watch times and likes and all that stuff. That's all going to count towards them too. So it's just another revenue site for them. Yeah. For free. So that is one thing to be on the lookout for whenever we can get it here. Right now, like I said, it's in Japan, but it's called Anime Lock. And so that's that's going to be a pretty dope one to look. I'll just question. Um, <laughs> uh, write it down or whatever. Uh, okay. Third, it kind of goes with you, Domingo, with, on your uh, avatar. The avatar creator. Uh, Netflix. Uh, yeah. So they walked away from the live action Netflix uh, show that they're, they're supposed to be trying to have a Netflix mm -hmm. show. The creators that got brought in of and uh, Avatar are actually they walked away from the show because at first they they were going to have like full control but then the way they were taking it it was taking it in a way that they don't want to be a part of because basically Netflix is taking it away as the movie did so oh. it's going the route it's going that route of the movie yeah uh, we don't that's a that bad that. sign. So hopefully they can reel that back and fix that because they do not want to go down that route. Netflix, okay. Okay. Yeah, so so hopefully they can get them back and get that under control. Hopefully we can get that under because we do not want to, uh, that freaking remake of that. Give it give it two months. Give yeah. it two months and Netflix, okay. So they like money. They'll another thing, uh, 
Oh, also, I forgot with the, the whole anime and the kitsune going on. Uh, there was a voice actor uh, that was with an, uh, the Funimation voice actor, the, uh, Alex Moore. She, after, you know, after the whole kitsune going down, everybody, all the fans panicking about it and everything, uh, they, you know, everybody goes to Twitter and all that stuff. There was a whole, whole ordeal, and you can Google it. That there was this thing. She was actually attacking fans and calling, and was actually calling pirate uh, the ones that were actually pirating the the anime uh, and people watching that, going there watching. There, she was referring to them as colonizers. Like she was like, you're attacking your fans. Like in some of the like, even on the comments section, like they were going down the comments like. Some of the people were saying that this is the only way they can watch it. Like it's not available in their country. This is the only way they can watch it. And she was like, "Well, it's not available to you." And I was like, "Wow!" wow. Like the way she was, uh, the way she was answering the fans. Like you don't deserve fans. I'm sorry. Yeah, that's, and that's even good. the way she was, the way she was. If you go through, and the way she was talking to them. So yeah. you're calling them colonizers, but the way you're acting is a co- you are the colonizers. Right. Right. It's like so that's a whole ordeal going on right now. I don't know how that's going to turn out, but she she's kind of digging that way. She don't want to go. Yeah. Uh, so I forgot to mention that about. Uh, I was supposed to mention that with Kitsune. Um, Avatar. Um, the toy, uh, I, I looked up uh, Tsunami, um, and I looked up the lineup for Tsunami, because uh, they are still running anime, so if you, if that's the only way you can watch the anime, uh, I know some, if you don't have an Xbox like Mingo, and you watch, <laughs> uh, you watch, go, uh, you have to watch it through it, so Tsunami, Tsunami is really behind, and really behind, really behind. Today on all animes, but you can still watch them. So uh, starting at 12 o'clock, it starts off with Dragon Ball Super. There is a new, uh, there's a new one coming to the lineup and it's coming at one o'clock and it's through the assassination at that uh, classroom. Classroom, uh, yeah. It's a pretty good anime. So at 12 o'clock, Dragon Ball Super, 12.30, JoJo's Bizarre Adventures, uh, 1 a.m. will be the assassination classroom. 30 you can watch Black Clover. Uh, 2 a.m. is Fire Force. 2:30, uh, Naruto Shippuden, and three is Samurai Jack. So they're still. It's not as great as it used to be. Back when we were watching, when we were watching Tsunami, they had a lot of lineup. This is kind of they kind of down it, dumb it down. But so hopefully uh, you can still watch it if you want to stay up late on for Tsunami. It is, um, it is kind of nice they still run in Samurai Jack. I like Samurai Jack. The, the next couple of things, basically, mm-hmm. there's new, there's some new uh, uh, mangas coming out. Uh, like there's a is one called Kaiju Number Eight. It's one to look out for. Uh, Kaiju. Kaiju Number Eight is the next. Uh, pretty much, there's only seven chapters right now, uh, and that's on so, uh, Sojin, uh, Shojin Jump Plus. Uh, that actually the Black Clover cr- uh, creator gave it a recommendation. So mm-hmm. it's one to look out for. Uh, you can go read those chapters on it. It's, it's about, uh, it's not the typical uh, Sojin um, title. You know, like usually when you're watching it, it's, it's, you know, it's always like about a teenager coming up, saving the day, getting powers, blah, blah. Like it's always like, well, this one, mm-hmm. the the main creator, the uh, main actor, or uh, is actually in his 30s. So, and yeah, Bob Kaiju is about. It's basically the guy. Um, he actually his job is literally cleaning up monster shit. Wow. And somehow he actually gets powers. He actually gets, and he can turn into a kaiju. But he, what he does, he does it differently. He actually can, he controls his transformations where nobody even knows he transforms. So it's pretty interesting. So 
like I said, it's one to watch out for. Um, the the other ones, uh, Burn the Witch. The ah, I heard about that. This Burn, this Burn the Witch spinoff that I talked about a while back. Uh, their volume one is going to be on October 2nd. That's the release of the manga. They also, they also released the anime version is in October 2. Uh, the, the when it starts. Um, a couple of other ones. Uh, there's a new upcoming anime. It's called Nobilis. It's about oh, it's, it's on. Uh, it's a Crunchyroll original, and it premieres oh. in October. It premieres in October. It's kind of a Dracula, like there's crazy powers and noble. And he has like this noble blood. He wakes up after all these years, and he has these. His noble blood gives him these powers. And he goes to this, they enroll him into the school so he can learn what's going on uh, with, in the world. And, you know, stuff starts happening. He has to use his powers. So, I'm down yeah. for that. But it looks dope. So there's mm -hmm. one that looks. Uh, also, there's two other ones that are making really good headway like Tower of God and God of High School. Those are really yes. good. Uh, doing really good in the uh, and in the manga. There's uh, Chainsaw Man. Is actually doing really pretty, really good. Uh, it's climbing the the, the logs pretty well. Uh, in the top, you know, they, they have like top ten. Uh, and also, there's a Juju. Uh, Did you stop? Did you just say what I think you said? Did you say climbing the logs as in chainsaw, log? I, I hate you. I hate you so much. I don't. That wasn't even the third one, was it? That's not even <laughs> what you're supposed to do. You just you just made that one up right now, didn't you? Yeah. Uh, I didn't know you were going to catch it. God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. That's pretty smooth, wasn't it? Okay, uh, it Damn it. Jujutsu Kaisen. That's one to look out for too. That one's gonna be. That one's going. It's getting right up there. Uh, and all right, went through all of them. I'm trying. I was trying to get through these. Cause there's a lot. Just fucking on news. Uh, the last one. There's a. There was a. There's a uh, anime called X H. It, it was out for a while. It's called X Age, and the uh, the author actually got arrested for a, like basically he was like not gonna get into what he. There's a lot of bad things he did. So basically, they are they are taking everything down with this anime. You are literally not going to be able to get this anyway. There's a lot of fans of it, but. They're taking it down like it never happened because of what he did. So they are burying this. <laughs> so he did so some bad age, shit, If you were a fan, sorry, it's gone. He did some terrible yeah. things, man. For him to do that, it must have been really Black bad. Blackballed you. Yeah. yeah, you get blackballed. Blacklisted. You fucked up. So, I mean, that's really all. Awesome. I mean, I know there's a lot, and I'm sorry I, I went, but hey, there's a lot to it's all good, good no stuff to know, good news. What's that? What you got? So, uh, the Dracula thing I'm down for because I, I like originals, and the fact that Crunchyroll has an original, it, I, 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 I'm, I'm excited because it's. I'm kind of wondering what they were gonna do. I've been hearing for a while now that, well, for a while now that they were talking about going into the anime making, like making their own animes, like kind of like I think Netflix did a little bit of that. And it's so so, some are good, some are bad. But I'm interested to see what Crunchyroll do, because Crunchyroll is like head first in there. So I kind of want to see how great they're do. Yeah. They're doing they're starting, I know that, um, They are starting they're starting to do their, their originals. Uh, and they're pretty damn good. They the they, that's the next upcoming one is Nobles. You know, anymore. And, that's um, the thing. I think you kinda have to try to do some kind of originals. I mean Anime, uh, um, anime. Huh. I mean, Amazon's got originals. Netflix has originals. Why I think not that's what they, whenever, you know, like anime, uh, Amazon started doing their original, uh, Netflix. Netflix.
Netflix yeah. kind of started it. Yeah. Before Netflix. Everybody else can. They had their yeah. original shows, and, and, and that, I think that's what kind of spun everybody else. It's funny because Netflix kind of banked off of uh, comedy special first. That was like their thing, comedy yeah. special, and then like the, it's like the money they got from that, they started, you know, producing their own movies and stuff, productions, and some of them are good, yeah. bro. The old guard, yeah, it's dope. Yeah. So I mean, yeah, yeah. I like I, it. I watched it. I watched it, and at first when I, I was hearing about it, I thought it was a series. Nah, it's a movie. Yeah. I know it's a yeah. movie. Duh. I just said it. I just, I literally just said it. I thought. Don't get all mad. Don't be a sequel. Cut. No, no. The reason I get mad is because every time, every time I say that I watched the movie, movie, I said movie, that so you watched it first I of all. thought. Anyway. Every time I, I watched it, I already watched it, so I know it's a freaking movie. You just said it, but okay. I just watched it. And it's it. a movie. I know it's a movie. Me, me, me. Uh, Why are you so angry? Because you keep fucking interrupting me. Shut up. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm saying that every time I say that I watched it and I was like, I thought from hearing about it, I thought that it was going to be a series that you can watch. It was going to have episodes. And then I yeah, watched yeah. it and I was like, oh, this is a movie. And then I tell you, like, oh, this is a movie, yeah. That's what yeah. you're talking about. And okay. every damn time they say that fucking quote, oh, no, it's a movie. Duh, okay. I, I watched I, it. I apologize. <laughs> I just wanted to make sure that everybody at home. I know knows. it's a movie. No, it's a movie. But I apologize. I can see why that would be irritating. Next time I see you. No, I can see why that would be irritating. <laughs> I got you. The, I, I get the it. The next thing I want to talk about was uh, Toonami. Um, well, I'm not talking about it, but to, I remember. My sister told me that Toonami said this because apparently they're, for some strange reason, they're the only people that go on Tumblr and, hey, here's all our big news on Tumblr. I think they're just now going to other sites. I don't know. Whatever yeah. she knows. My sister knows more than I do. But she said they, they said that, hey, we never, ever, for all you fans of the old Toonami back in the day, we never said we were full anime. We said we do what we want. So sometimes we might have anime. Sometimes we might just have some random cartoons. That's just action. That's just what we do. So why, if y'all mad that we're taking so long, it's because we're deciding what we want on there. And I was like, that's very Adult Swim-ish tsunami, but yeah, uh, apparently that uh, explains. Stop it. So, stop it. Do not say Adult Swim. They, no, because a tsunami is swim. in the Adult I, Swim. They're... No. Well, they are. Tsunami is Tsunami and Adult Swim and Adult Swim. They but used it's... to be, it used to be, I I rebuke that shit. I'm sorry. No, they're, hey, a, a tsunami is on the Adult <laughs> Swim hours. Like, it's I at night that. and fuck Adult that. Swim owns tsunami now. I'm Cartoon sorry. Network doesn't own I'm it anymore. sorry. Adult I'm just Swim saying. has paint. Adult Swim has reached the bottom of the motherfucking pool, goddammit. You know what I'm saying? You do understand what I'm saying, right? Weird now, bro. But they uh, own Tsunami now. I don't give a damn if they own Cartoon Network everything. owning Tsunami. Now it's Adult Swim that owns it. So that's what I'm saying. Look, I'm just saying, Tsunami, <laughs> fucking Tsunami, like they used to be awesome. They used to be, I mean, it's still pretty dope. But yeah. I, okay, Tsunami is awesome. Adult Swim is what I'm really talking about. Yeah, Adult Swim. They have added kind of and they fucked up Adult Swim. Yeah, I'm just many, saying they too many weird ass shows, bro. Whatever. Yeah, yeah, the shows that they add in, like yeah. I'm like, why are you showing this stupid shit? Yeah, right. it's, it's weird ass. Mm, I hate. I, yeah, they're hoping I that so they bad. can find a robot chicken. They they're hoping to find something kind of like Robot Chicken and Rick and Morty that can give them that thing, so they're just trying everything. That's, That's the, the only, only thing. I can think of. Those are only two. Those are only two that I wouldn't care to watch. Yeah. Like, the and only see, two. And, see, and it I all started watch. with home movies. Yeah, was oh, yeah home movies yeah. is horrible. Yeah, all, weird, 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 weird. I swear that's where it started. Well, I, quit, I, I quit fucking with it whenever, like, when they really quit, like, showing the boondocks, pretty much. Yeah, I stopped, I stopped because awesome. the boondocks, I was on it. 
Like I gotta, I gotta watch Bill Swim because I got my show with the Boondocks. I gotta watch this shit. They stopped and I was like, eh. Yeah. Eh, yeah. I can get Bill Swim used to be freaking amazing when we were growing up. Now, yeah. whatever this damn animation that they they're showing, like we could do something better than this. Yeah. We whole, could literally, we could literally. I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell Mike. Mike, you you watching this? I know you watching it. Uh, you make you you create the stuff. We'll voice the shit. Yeah, we, it'll be we'll better than what they got. Yeah, because you got the bang. weird show with all the demons. And have y'all seen that? The weird show with the demons. Yeah, like, yeah that live yeah, action. Metal, yeah, that's metal. That's metal. Uh, oh, don't no, not okay, metal. Not, not metal. Not that. That's that's. Well, like some of the, uh, that's like the office. That's like yeah, the office like version, the office, but with but demons. Yeah, like the office, but all demons. Yeah, it's yeah, weird, it's, bro. It's so stupid. I watched like right. forty-five seconds of that shit and like turned it off. Like, what the fuck? Yeah, it's stupid. Yeah, but like I said, we can literally we can do some stuff and send it in. We can get on a dope swim. I swear to God. They even reached with what's what's homeboy's name that got a show on there. And he acts like it's like a game show or like a talk show, but he's got oh, the crazy hair. Yeah, that's stupid. Yeah, like they, uh, they reached. They even reached with him trying name. to get him on there. Like he I always like him. yeah, uh, the something some stupid crap. Trevor Tyler, some no, not Tyler, it's, uh, but something. Andre something, Andre, Andre something. Uh, something unimportant. That's all. Anyway, yeah, we can. Uh, and then last thing, last thing, I, I, this, this is the big question, which was, and I'm, 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 a, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna try to make it a like a, I'm gonna try to say it so it won't be like super debate, but I really do hope that the free anime YouTube comes here, but I'm concerned, only yeah. because we're America, and that in itself should kind of give away. It's just the fact that. I'm not saying Funimation would. I'm not saying Crunchyroll would. I'm not saying any of the others, but just based off how she, that that lady reacted as a voice actress, I can just, I'm hoping this doesn't happen, but I can just see a lot of other voice actors being like, Please. so do we get paid? Because it's, 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 it's more about the English voice actors feeling like, well, we need our money, and or the companies being like, well, we want our money, so they won't want it to be free so i'm that's what i'm worried about well that, that, them them not opting in that's the thing most of it when it comes out uh they're going to be english subtitles first on the on this on this youtube basically you're going to be able to watch the anime you have to read subtitles uh they are working they said that they are working on getting the english version like english dubbed and stuff but like some of the animes that will go on there, like some of them, they're already freaking made. Like all the ones that already been made and already been dubbed, so they can just take that, throw it on there. Like it's already done. So they're already gonna put that. So they got a lot of titles that's already freaking done. And they just yep. upload to YouTube. I'm gonna tell you right now, uh, they're, they're gonna have the revenue because they're just gonna put the ads in there. Yeah. That's what and they're gonna do. the voice actors, they're gonna get freaking paid. I mean, say they'll, they'll cash they, in off of that. They're air. going to get paid because they're gonna put it on YouTube. The people, anytime they, that show gets freaking watched, they're gonna have to pay. Like, they they'll get there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I mean, yeah, I'm, I, and that's what I'm hoping for. I was just worried because you know how people, you know how like with Marvel well, and Sony and all the stuff I like, like that. It. Oh, Funimation be like, well, we license this. For our English actors, you can't use it on YouTube for free. You know, I just well, see, not they, saying that Funimation would do that, but I'm well, just worried will. about they will. Uh, you know, stuff like that. No, I'm saying they they are. I I guarantee you they are. But I'm saying that uh, they're working with all like all the all the uh, companies in Japan. They are trying to fight the pirates, so they know what it is, and they know that everybody goes to these sites. They and they see. They see that everybody likes the free, so they're gonna put it out for free in YouTube. The ads are gonna pay for it. You know, the ads like and you can ad skip an ad and, but they still get paid for it, even if they skip it. So it's uh and in the watch time, the watch time, bro, they're going to watch the fucking episode. They don't give a fuck how many ads, they're going yeah. to still watch it and it's gonna watch it all the way through. Like our episodes, they probably don't even watch all the way through. Uh, so pretty much like <laughs> kind of like Fortnite, <laughs> kind of like how Fortnite and um and Warzone and all the and all the others, the free to play, 
they don't have free to watch. So we finally yeah. went over to free to watch. Wow, that's yeah. So wow. So I like I do like this because I like that now. the actual company that makes the anime are actually helping the the fans. They are appeasing the fans. That I like that. So it, they are working for the like. They know they're going to make the money off of it, and they know that they're also going to have the fans actually watch the show, because that's what they go to Kissimmee for. That's what they go to those pirating shows. So, so like, well, if they go in for free, let's put it on YouTube for free. It makes sense. It yeah. makes sense. Like, if they're not, uh, if they can't pay for the subscription, which some people do, go because certain episodes, certain shows are still going to be on subscribed channels. So, uh, and the pirating, like I said, they have uh, it's. Kissimmee got shut down because they have uh, they are required to follow certain rules, uh, privacy rules, at the moment, and they can't get around those privacy rules. So, uh, so they're not going to be able to get to certain episodes that are in, in being uh, streamed, like a, a Crunchyroll or stuff like that. So. I don't even know if I'm gonna be able to watch it on on my Xbox anymore. Mm, that's a bad I mean, I don't point. know. You can, if you when it comes out, you have YouTube. Well, on yeah, your Xbox. but boom, boom, on boom. the Xbox, but at the same time, the Xbox app that I watch, uh, there's I have there's Kissimmee, but I have like five others, uh, five other different links. I don't know. I don't know if that's all pirated or not. If it is, if it is, it's gone now. Cause they don't I know. Shut them down. <laughs> shut them down. Shut them down. It was an and what you, and, yeah, and, uh, and Hammer, you said that November fifteenth for uh for um November the sixth for Cyberpunk, right? Cyberpunk. Yes. Okay. I may. Don't quote me on this. Don't hold me on this. Do not bring this up every episode. None of y'all. Hey, I call bullshit say, already. I, I might. Say that looks this fool. Bullshit already. Get that on Xbox. Because hey, I hey. like that game. See, I was going to get on PlayStation, but if it's co-op and y'all really need my help, because y'all really need me to help save the world, hey, I bro. got you. Hey. I call they, bullshit already. Give us something to do. Hey, maybe some content. You never know. Bullshit already. Hey, man. Where's your Xbox? Hey. Hey, bro. Wait a minute. Come on. I'm not in the room with go my Xbox. Go get it. Go get it. <laughs> yeah, he's going to go, go in there and unplug it. the it's, Xbox. It's, no, 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 no. Wait, is wait CD wait Project wait, Red wait, wait, wait. Cyberpunk out wait. yet? No. Uh, Ray, you said unplug? That bitch is still in the box. He didn't oh, open that shit. Oh, I've man. opened it. I've taken it, it out. I've in, turned it, it on. It ain't plugged it's, in. Is it? it ain't hooked right up. Right now, is it? it's not plugged in because there's no go get TV it. in that room. Go get it. Why would I go do that? That's there's no reason cool. to go. I'm not plugging it, it in. See, I don't have, do it. have to do that, man. See? Like that. I'm not plugging See? it in right now. See? What does it have to do with CD See? Project Red's uh, Cyberpunk? Go get hey, number six. What? Why you have to do it? See? Listen, I if, you, if you go get it, if you go get it, we'll like definitely I said, play it. Already. I think it's going to be an awesome game. I think it's, you know, like I said, it seems like a, a mixture of like GTA, Assassin's Creed, and Watch Dogs. It's like all of it in one, but like massive open world. So oh, yeah, I've, I've seen it, man. It. I, I'm, I'm, I'm down for it. Yeah, but, it, hey, yeah that sounds, that sounds I blame, like, I blame Snake and I blame Kaza because they they go when it's like oh Mingo we getting ready to go get division just talking about that one by the way we don't get division you should get division on Xbox pretty soon go ahead and get it. okay yeah I'm gonna go, I'm gonna get that I'm just gotta save up some money get Xbox or save up some money get ready to get the game by the time I save up the money to get the game guess who's free. already like ninety levels ahead. <laughs> Yes. Them. And guess who don't want to play no more? Me, because I don't want to do that. I'm done. Who's like, fault is that? No I, I, I deal with that all the time. Oh, so you just blaming us now? 
I do. Yeah, why don't you wait? Why don't you, why don't you level why progress Why would we wait for you? No, just would we level wait? progress slowly. Why would we slowly. wait for you to Look, decide to go? One get level today? a day. How hard is that? One uh, level a day. How hard is that? One level a day. How that's hard is that? extremely hard. <laughs> Look, all you gotta <laughs> do is progress. Look, play everything else, and then the games you play with me, one level a day. Okay, so okay. I get that. I'm gonna add, I'm gonna add that's to the Xbox person, Ray. Uh, playing division. How uh. When you know when the weekly person comes out, like yeah, how hard is that to do? Okay, that? to be fair, to oh, be that's fair, that's now. When it no. first came out, they didn't do that. To be fair, Mingo, like especially when they be having these events and different stuff, bro, you get like so much. You, gotta, you, you like you'll be you playing. Be on it. You honestly, you could be playing and go up like four levels and not even know it. I've done that. I, I've been playing and like just playing and playing and playing, and then I look up and my level is like four spots different because I that's wasn't not, paying attention to that. That's that's not them though. What they doing on purpose? Well, they, Kyle's always have, make sure he's seven yeah. levels ahead of, of Snake. But no purpose. You no, know, they're like, the oh, time. Mingo's first not gonna play. Mingo's first taking too long. Let's jump to level no. one million. Why? Because we can. That's no. what they do. No. That's no, no, what they no, do. No, 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 no. <laughs> yeah. I I do what I do to try to keep up with Kaiser. Yeah, Kaiser is. You don't blame anybody. You better blame Kaiser, goddamn it. I've been still trying to figure out how he fucking does this. Like, Kaiser has a whole job. And I understand, like, right now with everything going on, it's a little different for him. But Kaiser got a whole job. I'm trying to understand how does he level so goddamn fast. Look, like, I, I, Kaiser's a mystery in himself because not only does he have time to level up like that, but there are times where his job will say, oh, you could go home early. And he works maybe some hours. But then this dude right here has an entire house by himself that he rents or whatever. And so this, so it's like he has the best world. He's like, yeah. hey, I play games. I work no, for this amount of time. <laughs> and I bought a house. How many of y'all can do that? I can work this little bit of time. I can play games this big amount of time. And I got a house. Boom. And he secretly has a supermodel girlfriend and he's a billionaire. Uh, I call bullshit on that one. You can't prove it. You can't Man. prove it. I can. You can't prove it. I can prove it. You can't. You can't prove, I can it. prove it. You can't. I can prove it. It's just going to take some time. I don't prove it. <laughs> I don't think you can. <laughs> hey, bro. Get, get off the damn No Man's Sky and wrap up the show first. I'm not on the game. What are you talking about? We're talking okay, on the game. that's why you just keep looking up at the damn TV. Son of a bitch. Not the there lie. Yeah, I'm at the you light. ain't got to lie. He's looking at the light on the on the ship on the TV. I'm telling exactly. you, I'm telling you playing a game. I'm telling you. I'm not. Okay. So if I turn my Xbox on right now, I'm not gonna see that you in No Man's Sky. Oh no, you're gonna see that I'm in No Man's Sky. Playing the game. I'm not doing nothing. As he stares at the screen, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> <laughs> uh no. Nah. I was just running over here to the base to get my oxygen. <laughs> As I said, well, this is why I told you he was looting when we were fixing to die. This is verifies what hey, I was talking about. No, 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 more, no, 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 <laughs> okay. I, I, he, he knew he I actually do that. play instead of this dude. See, he I wasn't even doing anything. Do I was just buying my own business. This guy? Waiting for the show to end. Then he's down here. He's, down here. he's underneath us. Yeah, this guy <laughs> down here. Hey, there Mingo. Mingo. Hmm? What? Weird, bro. It's weird. Why are you looking at me like that? What does a deaf gynecologist do? Oh, oh no. We punk no, 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 no. The show is oh supposed to end. God. That's not even. Oh my Answer God. the freaking question. What does a deaf gynecologist do? Jesus. I don't even want to answer this because there's this no way to answer it correctly deaf, and not be, and not be horrible. What does he do? A deaf gynecologist. He hears her? 
He read lips. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is so good. <laughs> That was fantastic. Holy <laughs> shit. <laughs> Bro, Mingo, you know that was funny. That was funny. I, look, it's not safe. It's not safe for children at any means necessary. But, bro, oh, you know the level of cheese in these, some of these jokes that Tyler's dropped, man. But that one in particular, come on, man. Uh, yeah, it didn't have no was cheese. That was, that was really was clever. Good. That was... That was that was slick. I, mean, I can't. First off, I can't drinking, take credit for none of these. I ain't never. I had made none of these up. I got these all on Instagram and YouTube and. Instagram. That is a that's a drinking joke. That's, uh, that, that one right yeah. there is better than the one I told y'all with the, with the plastic bottle. Like that that hands down. I got that. one more. Before we no, end this, before we end this, in before we end this, I got one more. I didn't even write this one down. But I've been meaning to ask both of y'all, because both of y'all, you know, y'all church goers and Bible books and stuff. So, okay. So, Mary. I'm out. Prepare to to curse, sir. I don't know. I just feel like you're going to like, ah, da, like yeah. that. Doing yeah. the, da, da. It's, it's, I just have a feeling it's going to be a, da, da, da. No, no, no. 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 Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. 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 Mary. Right. Mary. Okay, so Mary, Mary had Jesus. Okay. Right. Okay, so Jesus is the Lamb of God. Correct. Right. So does that mean that Mary had little lamb? Go. I quit. <laughs> Go home. Go home. Go away. Go away. <laughs> I, that's so stupid. That's so. Stupid. It is so. It is so stupid. Stupid. Hey, no, okay, we went face. from wait, 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 time out. We went, we went from cheese, adult content. Oh, that's kind of cool, clever adult content. You know what? I'm not even mad about these jokes. That was cool. To cheese, cheese. oh, it just went right back. It went. You gotta go. It, it was like it was the go stock full market. Circle, man. Got full circle. We gotta bring it back. Always fools her. <laughs> That's like a. I'm sorry, fans. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, fans. That's like a a, a, a tricky talking about Star Wars and how much they love it just to break it down in the end and say they love Star Trek and it just went <laughs> in there. That was really bad. Please <laughs> have a little man. You know. What do you think, Ray? <laughs> that was bad. Damn it. <laughs> <laughs> I hate your face. I do. <laughs> In the show, man. Damn. All right. Yeah, we have been, so we been at this for a long I was, time. I was, oh man, God. I was doing good. We have so much extra footage to like, if you ever want to make a blooper reel or a... Yeah, you can no, do that. Or, Get nerdy after hours. Yeah. I'm sorry, don't do that. Oh, yes. no, please don't put that, in. Don't, don't put that in there. Yes. Don't put, put that in there. That that goes. That goes in there. Don't put that in there. No, it's all going in there. No. Uh-uh. Yeah, I can't end the end show because you you keep doing this. I can't edit it out. I'm trying to end it. Y'all keep fucking talking. Uh. End the show because you keep <laughs> these jokes that you keep like sliding in there. <laughs> That's the <one>. I'm done. <laughs> No, you're not. It's just come on, end the show. Well, all right, people. Th- uh, that's our show. I can't even end it. Oh my god. Okay, so all right. Thank y'all for coming out. Thank y'all for uh hanging in with us all this time. because uh, this is a long episode. Very. Very uh, long. again, go to YouTube. Hopefully y'all like the content and just remember to like, subscribe, comment. Uh, remember, yeah. uh, just go down there and comment in the description with the, uh, you know, talk to us. Like, we want to have somebody on the show. I want to have somebody on the show down in that box where we can actually communicate and get through the show with us. Yeah. If you want to be on it? Message. Come share your nerdiness with us. 
If y'all want to, if you see this and you want to be on the show, send me a message. Yeah. We will, we will get you on the show. For sure, for sure. So, remember to go like and subscribe. All right. We're going to hit this. Uh, let you see you on next Sunday. Yeah. Yeah. Later. All right. Talk nerdy to me. Get nerdy with me.